and hold it. I want to see Jerome. He said, hold it. He's clean. Mr. Jerome isn't going to be too happy to see you unless you got some good news for him. What is he? Is the job done? Don't you ever call my home again. Since when do you give me orders? I told you I'll take care of Carruthers. I'm going to do it my way and I want you to listen. To what? More excuses. You're wasting my time. You bully boys don't try me one bit. You made the trip. You must think it's important. Sit down. I gave you my word I'd take care of Carlos. I'm gonna keep it. I don't have to kill him to come up your way for good. I want him dead. I will put the fear of God in him. I will teach him a lesson he won't forget. He won't bother you anymore. I'm not going to kill the man. I'm not killing anyone, not for you. Not for anybody else. What do you think I am? You think I'm running some sort of scout troop here? I give an order. When I do, it must be obeyed. If it isn't, if you defy me, I lose face. I'm not defying you. I'm merely offering another solution, a compromise. In my world, there is no such thing as compromise. All right. Now you've had your say. I'll have mine for the last time. You have till the end of the week to make good on your promise. You'll kill Carruthers or else. Or else what? Don't force me to answer that, Duke. Believe me, you don't want to know. for the sophisticated alarms that Robert installed, huh? Well, I switched them off. They're too much bother to keep... So it's really fine. Actually, you didn't mean to sneak in here. I tell you, I love you. How much I missed you. <laughs> and then eventually I'm gonna ravage you. Oh. <laughs> You're better, aren't you? Yeah. I brought you a gift. Can we talk fast? Why did you get to New York? I told you before. No, why? Why did you get? Business, I told you. Well, which business was it? Was it a food and wine distributor or was it for sound equipment? What is this? The third degree? Well, it's just you told me one thing and Angel tells me something else. Oh, I see. So you have to check out with Angel. No, he, he volunteered the information. He also said that there was nothing wrong with the business. It was very good. Why would he lie to me? Oh, come on, he didn't lie. He told the truth as he knows it. What do you mean? Well, I don't tell Angel everything. I mean, if I did, he would blame himself for mismanaging the club. That's all. I don't want to hurt his feelings. Oh, by the way, I brought these. New, new food prices, new liquor prices. I, uh, I brought them home so I can go over them. Do you want to see them? No. I'm a bit stupid. I don't think you're stupid. I just think you're a wife who worries a bit too much about her husband or something. Mm, I'm sorry. Mm. Maybe the next time you'll believe me when I tell you something. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> 
Yeah. Sit down, I've got a gift for you. Oh, no, I think you shouldn't spend money on me. What is it? <laughs> what is it or what? Uh, You're going to look a gift horse in the mouth. I'm certainly not going to take it back. No. Might as well open it. Okay. Nice. Oh, this is gorgeous. You like it? Yeah. It's so soft. Hmm. Hmm. It'll keep you warm next time we go to Scotland. It'll keep me warm here. It's freezing outside. Whew. You'll probably get much better use out of it in Scotland. I'd like to go back there with you and Robinson. Yeah, I'd like to go back in a few years. I'd like to go back very soon. Don't do that. You worry me. Why? Right. You can't go back to Scotland, when your business is in trouble. Why don't you just let me worry about the business? Huh? Come on. Any other wife would be absolutely delighted if her husband offered to take her to the place where they spent their honeymoon. Oh, I'm delighted. Mm. I'm just worried. Mm. Do I have to call him Aloysius P. Dog? No. Well, that's what you said Jacques called him. I know. You can call him whatever you want to. I wish you were real. Oh, dear. <laughs> if you were real, I'd give him a very, very good name. Yes, I'm sure you would. Come on, give us a hug. It's time you went to bed. Mm -hmm. You gonna sleep with him tonight? I'd sleep with a real dog. No, you wouldn't, because I wouldn't let you. <laughs> Where did you get that from? Duke gave it to me. How come? I'm not sure. I'm not sure of a lot of things.